Just a bit tired, that's all. Yeah. Well, uh, I'm off to swan around that Covent Garden of the North precinct. Then I'm coming to annoy you at the bistro. Oh, yeah, speaking of which. I'll see you later. Bye. Well, I'm popular. Well, Ryan is still talking to you. Aren't you going to introduce me? Sorry, uh, yeah, I'll, yeah, she runs speed R. This is my old mate, Lolly. Hi, nice to meet you. Don't speak too soon. See you later. Bye. Oh, well, you're full of the joys of spring. What is it? Uh, yeah, yeah. Come on. What? It's just Lolly. Since she's turned up, I feel like a third wheel sometimes. Ah, so she wasn't joking just then. She's more or less taking over the wedding planning, suggesting this, organising that. Have my my one. <laughs> oh, hey. Come to book a table. Sunday night, four people? Hey. Problem. 8 uh, p.m.? Okay. All booked. How's the wedding planning? Oh, crazy, but getting there. Yeah, lots to do. You said it. Is everything okay? Yeah. Only I was talking to Rana earlier. Oh. Did you know she's not very happy? What? Oh, this lolly. She just turns up out the blue. This lolly? What's it to you? Well, let's hear it. Well, it's what it's to Rana, actually. Why? What she said? Well, she feels she's being edged out. What, by me? Well, you've taken over the wedding, apparently. I've been helping. She never said she was unhappy. Yeah, well, you don't always, do you? Has she told you to say this? Look, I was kind of hoping to get you on your own, but like Rana said, it's kind of difficult these days. Look, I just don't want things to go wrong for you both. Well, I guess that's me off the guest list, then. Let me talk to Rana, find out what she really said. Don't be like this. You clearly don't like Lolly. Well, I can't say I'm mad on her, but it's not that. It's how she's taking over. This is our special day, not hers. I know. And here she is now, acting like she'll be a bridesmaid. I've told her that's not happening now. But it should be us two deciding everything. But from now on, it will be. And if she's really bugging you, I'll then invite her and send her on her way. <laughs> Don't be ridiculous. The worst I felt was a little bit insecure. Honestly. Honestly. I felt down when she sorted out the hotel. But now that I've seen it, it's great. <laughs> <laughs> but you're the most important person in my life. I'm not gonna let anyone get in the way of that. Or oh, me. <laughs> That's all I said. I didn't ask her to say anything. And the next time I see her, I shall drown her in a five mango smoothie. <laughs> so you don't have a problem with me and Kate? No, it, it felt strange sharing her with someone. But problem. Mm -mm. Oh, thank God for that. I'm sorry if I've been crowding you. No, I'm, I'm glad she's having fun. It's me you should be sorry. No, you don't have anything to be sorry for. No, I feel bad, though. After you sorted out as a free venue. <laughs> oh, enough now. Can we forget it? <laughs> right, let me get us some wine. Well, I won't say no to that. Let me go get it for you. Oh, let me help you. 